What's going on, like game, man? Hey, like I told y'all, man, we had this one right here coming today because we did the chip fire in the booth part three yesterday, man. And a lot of y'all told me it was uh, Buzzy Malone that Charlemagne the God was ripping the part, man. So, hey, I missed and said Rex 3 2. I didn't mean to say Rex 3 2. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know who it was, but I knew it wasn't Reds 3 2 because I already knew that he he actually liked Reds 3 2. I don't know why I said Reds 3 2 yesterday, but we finna check this video out, man. We're gonna talk about this shit together, man. The title of it, Charlemagne the God gives his views on UK rappers. And a lot of y'all know how Charlemagne is, bro. This nigga is very blunt, bro. This nigga don't give a fuck. That's part of what made him successful. Like, this man be trolling, bro. I'm trying to tell you. Let's get it. By the way, uh, Charlemagne from, me and Charlemagne from the same fucking place, man. We both from South Carolina, man. Let's go. Now, this is Fire in the Booth, freestyle segment from my rap show. And these are like clusters, top three, four at the moment. That's my guy. That's a... Uh... Kano. Kano. I'm going to play two minutes of this. Yes, sir. He already and knew I want to give you a reaction on it, yeah? Big man ting. I'm out here for the hit man ting. Yeah. Not a kid now, king. Up and down, not a wing back ting. Left Harrods with the big bad ting. Mike Cruz Paddy with the big bad ting. This is on, not a zigzag ting. Rambo for the riff raff ting. Shaq K for the click clack ting. Young bucks go and spit that skin. Don't come back unless you bring back sins. This Woo! is L's and I bring back wins. You can sing. Bro, my man said don't come back unless you bring back sins, man. I know this video ain't about breaking down balls, but y'all know that's what we came for, man. We came for Charlemagne to see what he was saying, and we still coming for the bars, man. We never getting away from the bars. Let's go. Call swim. What's beef? That's not what you mean. That's when you cover queen. It's black jacks, but don't bring back king. They just mm. black suits when man sing that him. <laughs> what you thinking about that, Charlemagne? That's tough. See, the thing is, right? His bars are crazy. Me, I got to get past the, the, the cultural yeah, language cool. barrier because the delivery sounded off, but he wasn't really off. Yeah. So when I'm listening, I'm like, yo, the bars are crazy. And once I get past the whole... Speaking on that, man. Speaking on that, a lot of Americans, they they don't understand the lingo. So that's why, that's like, as soon as they hear some UK shit, that's why they be like, yo, what the fuck is this? Because they don't understand. For one, they, they can't get past the accent. And second, they don't understand the y'all language. They don't understand y'all lingo. For me, it's very easy. First time I heard UK people talk like on like y'all niggas sound normal to me. Like I don't really hear shit. I don't really hear shit to be honest with you. I understand y'all perfectly. I understand y'all slang, everything, man. It's common sense. But a lot of Americans can't get past like y'all 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 lingo. Like they don't know what y'all mean by certain stuff. Like a lot of Americans be like, "What's man's?" Well, like, "What's man?" Like, cause you know how y'all say "man" all the time. They don't understand that. It's simple. It's simple as shit if you pay attention. But that's what he about to say, man. I already know what he about to say. I did off, but he wasn't really off. So when I'm listening, I'm like, "Yo, the bars are crazy." And once I get past the whole English accent, I get the flow. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So I, I, I thought that was dope. Personally. Facts. This next guy, his name's Akala. Akala. I'm a failure. I smile to myself. Shout out to Akala for getting his, his um, he, did he get his doctor's degree or some shit to be a, like, teacher or some shit? Whatever it was, it, it was, like, a, a huge accomplishment, bro. I saw it on Twitter, man. Shout out to Akala, man. These times I was on the plane to Australia, sold out shows on the other side of the globe, but fools only know what's in front of their nose, so they stun, pose, but they can't sell shows, cause the music is poo and they got no flow, I know, Ooh. you might be astonished, dog shit cannot be polished, mm. no matter how you push it on the public, so dog shit cannot be polished, bro, see, Akala, a I say Akala, man, Akala, he, sound, he sounds American, bro, like, I don't even hear the UK accent when he talk, like, he sound like how we talk. Like he 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 could talk fluently in both in both in both countries, bro. Like he sound American right here, and but when you actually like hear him talk, like you could tell where he from. But like when he rapping, he sound American, bro. 
done You cannot make them love it, son You know how many rappers could pack out a venue in Addis Ababa Guess what? It was the only one Bob Marley ever did play in Africa You write raps, I write history on the page And quite literally an yeah. elder statesman to my own generation An inspiration, cause the flows that I came with Is a solo play by Miles Davis Who don't know is the greatest mm. So if Charlie tells anybody else Their fire in the booth is the best there's been Ooh. Is he high? Does he lie? Nah, he knows Carla, what you thinking, Charlamagne? That's crap when he hit the rest of that shit. He in pocket. Like, I'm telling you. Like, he's in the beat. Like, his flow is retarded on yeah, that. Yeah, like, he, he got it. That, that's, that's dope. Like, his flow is, like, he's in the beat. Like, he that's dope. That you got to check the full thing out. That's crazy. He goes in on that. He murders that. All right. So this is Rex Free 2 and Avellino. I mean, how much more gems can I drop on the few? I was trying to see. I was trying to see that he had Buzz Malone coming up next. Cause they said they they chopped it out. I was trying to see, cause he got all the videos lined up already. So he when he get finished with one, he just pressing the X button. I was trying to see what's buzzing Malone up there. I couldn't really see see a Kayla right there, a Kyla right there. You yeah. mother's that. I. And see, you see Avelino right there. I'm trying to see who that is. That look like Red. So this is Red Three Two and Avelino. I mean, how much more gems can I drop on the future? How much of my fans might just not buy my new stuff? Well, you all got bars, but nobody hears a brew. I bring in sandwich to the beach in the hope of finding two. Now, this is nonsense. <laughs> past tense. I'm a rap genius. I've passed sense. Yeah. So you ain't got a 2 1, or you ain't free to. You gotta graduate before you pass, wretch. We got oh on the wrong God. foot. You ain't got a 2 1, and you ain't past 3 2. You gotta graduate before you can. What? One, or you ain't free to you got a graduate free before two. you pass wretch we go off on the wrong foot because you half step meanwhile i'm getting restless we go off on the wrong foot because you have step bro i bro i i'm gonna i'm gonna be the first nigga to react to some shit twice <laughs> you gotta react to that shit twice to catch all the bars bro that's tough that's tough before you pass wretch, we go off on the wrong foot because you half step. Meanwhile, I'm getting restless because I can't rest. Mm. 21 hours I'm awake, the other three I'm in a daze writing what to say with my last breath. Can you not hear the difference? Perfect. Even when it's in your system, every time I flip the script, I got a scripture. I've seen man go from the strip to the strip club. I'm trying to go from eating rich tea to the rich club. I used to want to go from the bitch to the bricks, cuz, and then I realized that it's a fix when your skin's dark. Yeah. Should I do a Kanye and keep the chiller? Fuck that. Even when I lose, I'm the winner. Best too. What do you think about that? That's phenomenal. That's the yeah. fucking goat, nigga. <laughs> crazy. Ain't no phenomenal. He the incredible. fucking goat. That's dope, man. Like, are they popping out there? Popping. Word, popping. Word. Like, the yeah, scene over there right now. It's I mean, never been so healthy, bro. Yeah, you just played me three dope ass rappers. Facts. Do you think that a UK artist. See, they can buzz right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. There you go. Right there. That's buzzing alone, bro. Ain't that fine the boo too? Hold up. Is that fire in the boot too right there where he had that uh that green looking I think it was like a green jacket? Is that two or one? Y'all let me know. I can't I don't feel like looking it up. But that there it go right there. That's buzzing Malone. That's buzzing Malone right there. It did over here in the States. Yeah, I just think it's about the right production. And the reason I say that is because like when I listen to the three dudes you played me just now, the third dude Sounded the dopest to me, and the reason he sounded yes, the dopest sir. is I never had heard that beat before. So being that I never heard that beat before, I don't have no expectations. Yeah. So I totally felt the marriage between his lyrics and his and flow in that beat. Yeah. The second dude's flow was incredible, and he was going over designer. Yeah. So it just, you know, uh, uh, you know, sonically just uh, was appealing to me. It's gonna be the hot. first yeah. guy had bars. That makes sense, bro. They make perfect sense with uh, Charlamagne saying. Like, that's what I like about Charlamagne. He gonna tell you the fucking truth, bro. He not gonna fucking lie to you. Goddamn, like you said, it's all, it's all about... Over here, man, over here, man, it's about beats, bro. If somebody can bop their head to it or they can dance to it, like, bro, it, like, niggas gonna like it over here, bro. Like, far as, like, it ain't too many lyrical artists left that's going hard. But in, in America, but if you got a hot beat, and they can bop their head to it or dance to it, it's gonna be hot. So basically that's what he's saying. The the uh the UK seem to be able to make it over here if they got the right production. Like if they got fucking Metro booming on the beat and got fucking like Rest 3 2 rapping on it, it it'll go crazy over here. That's what I'm saying. Like if they got a hot beat and, and they saying the right shit 
America accepted this shit. Like, I told y'all when I first heard Av Lino. Av Lino, he, he'll make it over here. Because some of his songs sound like American songs. Like his, and then his accent is not as deep as everybody else's is. Like, Av Lino sound American to me. So that's what it's, that's what it's about. Charlamagne telling the truth. And he had lyrics, but when I'm first listening, I'm like, oh man, that shit sound kind of whack. But then as I actually got to, you know, adjust my mind and say, man, let me get past the the accent and the language and just listen to what he's saying. And I'm like, okay, that was dope. So I just think it's about production, man. You got to find that right guy with the right lyrics, the right flow, and just find that right marriage, you know, for where a guy dude. like me from the States won't even care about the accent. I'm just listening to a dope-ass song with a dope-ass rapper on it. Facts. Facts. See, hey, see, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, man. Hey, like he said, like a lot of Americans lazy when it comes to music. Like if if, they, if it don't click with them, the first couple seconds, bro. Like that's how it is, bro. Like I'm being completely honest with y'all. Charlie need to bring me on this shit, bro. Like a lot of Americans lazy when it comes to music. If it, if they not bopping their head to it the first ten seconds, bro, they gonna turn it. They not gonna wanna hear it. It's not. It's not. It's not a lot of niggas that think like me and Charlemagne. Like they're not gonna actually like sit down and like be like, fuck that essence here. I'm trying to hear what he talking about. A lot of niggas don't listen to lyrics these days. They just listen to the beat. So that's what Charlemagne talking about. But to talk about that Buzz Malone situation, I wanted to watch this video just to see did we have any like hints about was it Buzz Malone that he was talking about. And it was. Buzz Malone was clearly on the screen. And the video went off. The video ended. So, Charlamagne, y'all was right, man. Charlamagne had to, like, say some crazy ass shit by Buzz Malone in this interview, bro. Like, for him just to cut it completely out, bro. That's tough. And that's tough. Buzz Malone still ended up blowing up independent as fuck, man. I salute it, Buzz. But yeah. That, that was what Chip was talking about, man. Like, like, let us hear it, bro. Let us hear the truth, man. Come on. Maybe Charlemagne would have said some shit in what... Maybe we would have heard some shit that Charlemagne said and the UK artists would have took it and ran with it. And maybe something Charlemagne said would have clicked in the UK rapper's head. This how we gonna get up. This how we gonna blow up over here. Maybe he said some shit that UK rappers needed to hear. That's what Chip was talking about. So that's why Chip won't want them to play the full clip. Because, hey, you never know what he said. Maybe what he said was something key to getting them heard over here, bro. You never know, bro. But if y'all enjoyed this video, man, y'all make sure y'all leave a like, man. I like these type of videos when America and the UK is, like, basically debating or colliding. Or even working together, bro. Y'all know I love it, man. Because that's what I'm here for. That's what I'm trying to do. And we going to get there, man. We going to be the biggest fucking channel. Bro, I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm telling you. This channel is going to be the biggest channel representing both countries, bro. It's tough, man. Let's get it.